My name is Kate and I am 26 years old. Um, I've been married for four years and I have a really, really cute two-year-old. I was challenged a couple of years ago to start this, to start meditating on the names and attributes of God, um, specifically using a podcast put out by, by Right Heart Ministries. And um, it completely changed my life. Um, I started listening and I remember folding my laundry and just hearing um, a certain name and attribute of God and, and, and that was seen in a story in scriptures. And it just stopped me dead in my tracks and it kind of just started from there. Not too long after I started really diving into the names and attributes of God, I hit a difficult situation in my life and um, I felt completely just broken. And I remember thinking, this is the worst. <laughs> like I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I don't know how I'm supposed to be feeling. Like I, my heart was just broken, and I just remember thinking, sitting and thinking, how am I okay right now? And the only thing that I could describe it was is that I felt sheltered. Um, my heart was absolutely broken, but over it, like I felt, I felt completely protected, and I think it was just because. I had been diving into the names and attributes of God and I, I felt like I finally knew him on a new intimate level that I had always longed for and I don't know how to describe it other than I was I just felt protected and um, that journey you know with grief has highs and lows and um, it was always an, that podcast and studying the names of God was always an anchor to me that could bring me back um, when my emotions were out of whack the, the podcast and knowing who God was and studying who he was brought me back to where my mind and my heart needed to be. In looking at scriptures and the stories in the Bible, um, I stopped looking at what God had done in those stories and I started looking at what he was doing in my story. And he stopped being, you know, just some big God that I couldn't ever reach to being a personal God to me. And um, in just seeing what he did and who he is, I knew that that's how he was in the past, and I knew that that's how he was in my life in that moment, and um, I'm just so thankful for the opportunity to have my eyes open to be able to, to look for him and to um, remind my heart, and the more that I remind my heart who he is and what he does and um, what his actions say about him, the more that I trust him, and when I can't see him, I know he's still there, and I can trust him. I can trust that because now I've walked it and now I've experienced it. I want to challenge you to take the next 30 days to download the podcast from the Right Heart Ministries um, and to just take the time to get to know God and to learn about His heart and um, take Him for who He is and get to know Him for yourself. Um, in a practical level, I'm taking this in with my, with my son as well. Every night when we pray, I to pick three characteristics of God that day that we thank Him for. And um, so I just want to leave you with this, that God is good, God is kind, and He never changes.